Um, nothing. But the reason is, is because every experience that we have with another person changes our lives fundamentally. So I will always remember how my life was changed by the class of 2022. Uh, the thing I will miss most about the class of 2022 uh, is the sense of humor that you all brought um, to the class. Uh, I had a few class of 2022 classes, uh, a couple freshman classes um, back in 2019, and uh, they all made me laugh pretty much every day. So that's what I'm going to miss most about them. What are you going to miss about the class of 2022? Hmm. Um, I'd have to say all the different personalities. Um, and I have two senior classes, and that just kind of sums up all the different you know characters we have. Um, we got people who are very serious, very funny. We got people who um, the athletic types, the artistic types. So I guess just uh, the variety of, of characters that you guys have. I am going to miss uh, their sense of humor. I'm going to miss their hardworking attitude. And I'm going to miss uh, their kindness. They were very welcoming to me when I joined Millbury, uh, and I always, uh, I will always appreciate. Oh, I'm on? Okay, great, great. Um, Ty, what I'm going to miss about you guys and you guys and you guys, I'm um, going to miss where you're going, how many laps you're going to take, how long you've been at the bathroom, oh, do you need a buddy system, I'm going to miss my math analysis, dysfunctional family, um, <laughs> Nate Hunt's Cotton Eye Joe, Cam's mullet, Tyler's pretend beard. Uh, oh, is that too much? Is that too much? Um, I wish you the best of luck. Congratulations. Love you all. Uh, I'm going to miss just seeing you guys around the hallways every day. I've known most of you guys since you're like 10 years old. So um, it's definitely been a long journey over the last like seven years, six, seven years of knowing you guys and just seeing you, whether it's in the hallways now because I don't have you in class or. Um, just around the school, around the community, I'm definitely gonna miss seeing you guys every day. I'm going to miss a lot about the class of 2022. I'm going to miss all my kids that I had in CDS all those years back, and I am especially gonna miss your sense of humor and your levity, and uh, how you guys were able to take school and kind of make it fun, and not so much take it so much seriously. Uh, and I'm going to miss specifically Brian Smith. Yes. <laughs> I am going to miss all of you tidy people tying up my mornings. Can I name them all? Wade, Gentiluch, Paris, Ayotte, Master Giacomo. I'm going to miss all of you guys. Julia Gulia Gentilucci. <laughs> so the class of 2022, um, I'm going to miss going to all the sporting events and watching the teams compete. That was really fun. I'm also going to miss the pranks and the practical jokes that I was fortunate to be involved in. Um, awesome group, super fun this year. Uh, wish you all the best. There you go. Uh, Jenna Lucci's Garage with the boys. Uh, it's definitely one I'm gonna miss the most. Had good times, there are many memories that I'll miss forever. Um, I'm gonna miss um, Cam Ayotte um, fighting in the basketball games. Definitely gonna miss Cam Ayotte. I'm just gonna miss all the memories in the locker room with uh, all my good friends. <laughs> Julia's Garage. What are you going to miss most about the class of 2022? Um, I'm going to miss all the parties. Shout out Derek Ferris. Um, I'm going to miss all the seniors that I've played sports with throughout the years. I'm going to miss the Hoko group chat and all the parties. <laughs> uh, there's many things I'm going to miss about the class of 2022. I've been able to uh, establish many you know, positive relationships, not only through football, but having all the kids in junior high health class. Uh, certainly not going to be the same school without you. Good luck, everybody. We'll miss you. What are you going to miss about the class of 2022? I'm going to miss all the seniors that I played football with. Miss about the class of 2022? Everything. This is the best class that's graduating since I've been here, and I've been here more than 10 years. <laughs> G-Block, 7th grade. <laughs> uh, so there's a few people I'm going to miss uh, for the class of 2022. Like Ty Pagore, uh, Tyler Schultz, <laughs> and Derek. I mean, those guys are those guys are fun. Shout out to uh, Ty, Tyler Schultz. He put me on my on my butt in football like four times. 
I mean, I'm gonna miss them all. They're all a uh, good thing, I would say. Hi, this is Joseph McNeil. I just want to say to the class of 2022, good luck with everything. You've worked so hard to get to this moment. And um, I want to say a specific congratulations to Miranda Swanson and Mateo Sosa. They've um, played unified sports the last few years, and they've been so great for our team. Great attitudes, great efforts, and I uh, really look forward uh, to the next few weeks with them. And um, also, um, being a part of the baseball team this year, all the seniors on the squad, Cameron Ayotte, Jaden Palumbo, Mark Garabedian, Blake Samuelson, those guys, uh, it was good to get to know them, and I'm sure they'll thrive in whatever they decide to do in their future. So. Uh, have fun, study up, have fun, bye. <laughs> I'm gonna miss cheering on everyone on the football and the basketball and all the other athletic teams. Um, you guys have been a lot of fun and really funny and nice to hang out with, so good luck next year. I'm gonna miss just about everything because I've known them since they were in seventh grade, so I'm gonna miss them a lot. Bye, class of 2022, see you at graduation. What are you gonna miss most about the class of 2022? I'm gonna miss um, a lot of the kids in this class. I had a great relationship with a lot of these kids. <laughs> I'm gonna miss this and the weirdos that are in the class of 2022. Can you see him? Yeah. Um, no, the personalities of the class of 2022, um, the way that you guys always figure it out and manage to come together and do what's gotta get done. Um, your resilience over the past two years um, especially through the pandemic and everything. You guys have been awesome, and um, I'm just going to miss seeing you guys in the halls every day. I'm going to miss MHS, too. <laughs> Good luck. I'm going to miss my softball seniors the most. Okay. What are you going to miss about the class of 2022? Our seniors in softball. What are you going to miss about the class of 2022? Uh, for me, um, I don't know if you guys realize this, but I started the same time you did. So we both came to MHS in <clears throat> six years ago. So I taught many of you in seventh grade. Then a couple years later, when they were looking for class advisors for your class, and Mrs. Flaherty asked me, um, I was like, ah, it's so much work. But then, I don't know. I, I am gonna miss all your distinct personalities. I love hanging out in the library with Mrs. Flaherty, with Rosie, and seeing you guys down here. Um, and I love the fact that you're all so different and you're all so funny. And it's only down here in the library that I really get to feel that because this is such a great place to hang out and to be. And so I'm gonna miss these times hanging in the library. Um, not so much the class times that I've had many of you in class, although I've loved having you in class, but really this is my favorite time because you're your real selves in here. And this is when I really have gotten to know you. I, I'm really going to miss the same thing. I'm going to miss you guys stopping in here. Um, there's so many people that just stop in during the day and say hi and hang out for a few minutes. And, you know, and that's when I hear about, like, your real lives and your lives outside of school. And, I, you know, I'm going to miss that. I'm going to miss all you guys just coming and talking to me. You know, that's, that's going to be a big hole next year. <laughs>